Hey guys, my name is Robert Welsh and I am a professional makeup artist. Today I have teamed up with ConsumerHealthDigest.com to give you guys my top tips for men's skincare. My first tip is knowing your skin type. There's a few different skin types and they go from anything from dry to oily. If you have dry skin, your skin is always tight and visibly flaky. If you have oily skin, you're always excessively shiny or greasy looking. If you're somewhere in the middle, then you can choose products from different areas of skincare and customize it to your skin's needs. My second tip is cleansing. Of course, we all cleanse our face. It's very important to remove dirt, sweat, unclogged pores, and just leave your skin feeling fresh. If you have dry skin, a cleanse cream is the best way to keep your skin hydrated and full of moisture. If you're on the other side of the spectrum and tend to be very oily, a foam or a gel is going to help to remove that excess moisture from your skin. Exfoliating is something that a lot of us don't do enough. It should be done once to three times a week. Exfoliating actually removes the layer of dead skin cells from the surface of your skin. This helps ingredients from your other skincare absorb quicker into your skin. It also helps the skin renew itself, so your skin always looks more luminous and younger. Do not do this more than three times a week and try to avoid the eye area completely. You don't want to use anything rough around the sensitive skin. Moisturizing is another thing that's very important for our skin. If you're going to do anything out of skincare, moisturizing is the thing to do. Moisturizers can help slow down aging, it can help even out complexion, reduce redness, the list goes on and on. It also comes in many textures, so if you don't like the feel of something greasy and oily on your skin, a gel might be the best option for you. These are quickly absorbed into the skin and they're very easy to apply. With the heavier creams, you may need to spend a little bit more time massaging and pushing this into the skin. Toning the skin helps to remove any cleanser that you haven't wiped off. It also helps to restore the pH balance in your skin. Sometimes if we use too much cleanser, we can dry it out, even those of us that are oily. Toners do a range of different things, from helping to close your pores, to exfoliating, to even softening your skin. This is a step that I think is very important not to miss out. Another thing that I am completely obsessed with is protecting my face from the sun. I like to use an SPF 50 every single day. This stops UVA and UVB rays getting to the skin and can help keep your skin tone nice and even. This also delays the occurrence of age spots and wrinkles. My last thing that you guys might want to try maybe once or twice a week is a face mask. These come in different forms and do so many different things. There is a face mask for everything. You can use a sheet mask, which you literally lay over the face, or a cream that will harden and just rinse off the water. They also come in gels that you peel off the skin. I hope this helped you guys out. Thank you so much to ConsumerHealthDigest.com for having me. Thank you so much for joining me and I'll see you soon.